What is going on, people? This is Fear D10. I'm bringing back another episode of 2K13, my team. And this is, well, not a, officially, this is not my first game in uh, my team. I played a total of five games. Yeah, I, I, my record is 2 and 3, so I lost my first game. And then I would have shown you the gameplay of my uh, first win, but I, when I was playing the guy, he quit it right after I was, you know, winning by 10 points. So that's why I didn't show you. So this is my second win. So my record right now is two and three. And um, it's crazy, man, because when I'm playing people in this uh, game mode, they just shoot like fucking crazy ass amount of threes, and it's hard to stop these people. I don't know. They, like the only thing I have noticed right now that it's really unbalanced the team sometimes because um, you get this uh, tribute skills, and uh, and sometimes people just put like. Not a whole mess of point, uh, like uh, skill points on their, on their, on some like regular players, like bronze players, and they just make them crazy ass shooters. And in that part, I don't like this part of this game mode where they just like, like right here, look, you can see, bam, he just shot a three on me. I don't even know who that guy is, but yeah, uh, but good. Luckily, I have pretty decent shooters like Austin Rivers and um, Dunleavy, and those are main scorers. And then in the inside, it's Lamar Odom. And I, I opens I got some packs and I hope like I opened like three of those uh, season season pass ones and, and I was disappointed on my on the players that I got they were not that good I think I got like two silver players and they're like old school guys but I don't even know who they are I think my best one was Jake McMillan or something like that and um, yeah I kind of just wasted like 10,000 on my VC points in there but it can be help I mean I'm gonna have to get more points, but yeah, I was like, I was also raining threes in here though. Not only this guy, but I chose my my uh, my shot though. Like I was trying not to, you know, not take too much one on one. Man, it's just really unfair, man. You're trying to. Like, I was playing good D, but then just sometimes it just, you know, you just let up. And um, yeah, but it was a close game, man. It was I found it competitive, but just that part that I don't like about like. Where they pull like uh, a crazy amount of skill points on one player that is normally not even good at threes, and then just suddenly when you do that, they become crazy at shooters. But I'm gonna have to get used to that, and hopefully next time when I open another pack, it gives me better players. Because I, I mean, I was gonna show it, but I was like, you know what, it's not worth showing these players that I got. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty disappointing, so I'll probably do it next time when I get enough points. But aside that. Man, like, what do you guys think about the game, game, uh, the first game of the finals, man? It was, it was crazy, man. I was like, it was pretty close, and unfortunately, it showed the experience of the, of the Spurs at the end of the, uh, the uh, fourth quarter, where the Heat were not making their shots, they were turning it over at the end, and it was just, it was an, it was just amazing finish for the Spurs, man. I don't know, man. How do you guys think about that buzzer beater by uh? What's it called? Uh, Parker, man. It was like, it was like not even a second. It was like a split mini second when like he released the ball and then the shot clock went off. I was like, damn. I was like, that was so really even hard when you even side in slow motion there. But it was, it would probably be one of those. Uh, this, this will be one of those games where you know you'll be talking about like ten years later. You know, one of those uh, games where you say, you know what, this is one of the greatest top ten finals games. Yeah, man, it was a close finish. But it looks like the Spurs are having the upper hand, and in game two, it's tomorrow, so hopefully it's, it's as good as this one. And now, originally, I was going for the Heat, but like, they were going to win it, but man, it just looks like the the Spurs, you know, they, they come and show up too, you know. They're, it looks like they won this champ because they're in the part of the last year that they will be able to make it to the finals, and the last chance that they'll have a chance to win it. And I'm... Um, I'm having my doubts now. The Heat, so I don't know. But I just want to. I'm loving the the finals though. It feels like it's gonna be one of those, you know, classics, instant classics. You know, it's gonna game game seven for the NBA championship. You know, and that, that's what I just all about, man. I want to see great NBA games. Yeah. So you just let. Yeah. I want to. I want to know what you guys thought of that game. I, I felt like it was one. It was a really good game. Outside of that, yeah, man, but I was talking about this gameplay. I'll be trying to do more of uh, my team, hopefully, and it's really hard to get VC points, man. I still haven't figured out how to get the most points. Usually, the way I've been doing it is just by playing uh, online team matches, and I feel like that's not enough, though. Like, there's another way, and I try to play my career, 
that gives you little points and you have to actually spend points on making your player better so I, I've been out even try to play a little more of that so yeah I mean if you guys have any suggestions on what uh, game modes or what what to do to get more busy points you know just let me know down in the comment box or you know if, even if you have any tips for me if we know how to like you know make this game play better or anything other than that and as well as you know I want to know I want to I want to know from you guys like do you guys think I'm doing a good job on my commentary if, you know all the games that I see if you have seen any of my other uh, gameplay commentary from uh, that I uh, that I'll be uh, you know I've been showing you guys and um, you know just let me know what do you guys think um, you know uh, even if you don't like what I'm saying or you don't I mean even if you don't care what I'm saying but <laughs> I want some feedback though I want to know like what's your thoughts on on you know on the things that I'm doing because you know I like I said probably this a thousand not a thousand times but like a lot of times I mean I'm doing this one because I want to show you my gameplay and two. Know, how like you know how I am as a gamer and you know and I just like talking about this thing it's not like I'm getting paid for it <laughs> you know that'd be great though but so aside of that yeah it was this was a really good game man I was like it was neck to neck at the end but then at the last seconds he, he just start she just he just start following me so I mean I had the game in the bag after this but yeah it was it was a really good game and hopefully I'll be bringing out more gameplay like this in the in the future because I hate it when you're playing and then you have a good you you have like a good group going on and then suddenly the player just quits on you man I was like that's just it's not fun like that you know you, even if you're losing just at least try to finish the game all the way and not just let you know just uh, drop off right in the middle all right you guys um. Yeah, there was another game, uh, another episode of my little series that I'm trying to do with my team. And hopefully you guys like it. And if you guys like this, I'll be bringing more similar things like this to my channel. And if you if you decide to stick around, please subscribe, comment, and like. I'll, I'll be seeing you guys later. That's what I was born.